Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm gonna be unboxing my February Twister Retreat box. I have been waiting for this box because I love receiving this box. Um, so finally it's here for the month of February. So let's go ahead and get this open. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, so we, there's the inside and those annoying peanuts so. though. <laughs> okay, so let me go ahead and see if there's a spoiler card in here. Um, and yeah, oh, also, look how cute this is. Uh, so they finally switched back to their normal boxes, and look how cute that is. Hopefully, it's in focus, but that's so cute. Um, unboxing, share your experience, enjoy your box of oddities and horror, and I think that's so cute. Um, hopefully you guys can see that, but I'm gonna see if there's the spoiler card real quick, and I will come back. Okay, so I'm back, and... We do have this spoiler card here, so I don't want to show you that, but I do want to see if there's a title for this one that I can't remember. I don't see a title or a name for this one, but it's February 2023. So, yeah, um, anyways, let's go ahead and open this big box first um, to see what it is. Oh, this one I was really excited for because it did a... Okay, so they did a sneak peek of this item last month on their Instagram and I love this item. I get this item from Illumicrate um, and I love it but I was so excited to see what Twitter Retreat does. Um, and there is a flower base pot, book pot, book pot. This is so beautiful. I love what they did. It's so nice. It says, A Hunter's Guide to Slaying Vampires. This is so, so cool. I love it. Um, and then on the back it says, Twister Retreat. And you're probably going to end more... Wait, sorry. <laughs> you're probably going to need more than just garlic. <laughs> um, I love it. Uh, like I said, I received these um, from Aluminum Crate. Uh, let me go ahead and grab it so you guys can see the difference real quick. Okay, so here's like the difference. Um, sorry, mine has bookmarks and stuff in it, but the Luma Crate one is just a tad bit taller. I don't know if you're really able to tell, but the Luma Crate one is just a tad bit taller. But yeah, I love receiving these. I love putting my bookmarks and stuff in there. As you can see, I have a whole bunch of bookmarks, so I'm glad I got another one so I can put the rest of them, split them up and put them in here. Uh, but I love the design of this one. Um, the Lumicry one, they, they do like foiling on it, and the Twister Tree one doesn't have no foiling. Um, but it's still so beautiful, so I'm very happy with it. I love the design. I think it's beautiful, and I love it. And hopefully, um, they do more of these in the future. Um, I would like to receive more, because they're so pretty, so yeah. Um, so the book shape vase pot, you might want to store some extra garlic in your book shape vase. The Tesla Caddy, the vampires are out. This exclusive vase was designed by typical.goals for this box and it has a general vampire bookish design. So yeah, I love it. I'm very happy with our first item. Okay, so we have another box here. So let's see. I think this might be our candle that we get every single month. And it is. So let's go ahead and get that out. Um, I like receiving candles, so I'm always happy with this. So this is, you're just, you're just in time to have your head cut off. Van Tassel, um, so I think Sleepy Hollow, yeah. So it's Sleepy Hollow design there on the candle thing. Um, and it's the tarot design they always do, and then on the top, um, there's that, which I love. So let's see how it smells like. I like it. It smells pretty nice. Um, again, I just very bad with scents and stuff. Um, I, don't, I don't think they ever tell you what um, the scent is, which I wish they do. So let me see, if, and maybe they do. Sleepy Hollow Candle and Tarot Card. This month's Tarot Card and Slash Candle is inspired by Sleepy Hollow. Is the Justice Major um, Arcana as they represent justice slash fairness and the reverse. Um, so it doesn't have the scent on it, which I wish it did. Um, I wish it was just, I, 
I hope later they put the scent on this color card because I have no idea. Um, and it doesn't tell you otherwise. So hopefully they do that, but I don't know. Um, but like I said, they have a matching tarot card. Um, so it's the same exact design on the candle, but on the tarot card. <laughs> okay, that went out of my hand. But I love receiving those as well. So the next item here is a Fiction Bath Co. exclusive item here. Um, Dracula. So I love it. I love Dracula. I love vampires. So this box, I really love the theme for. Oh, this one does have the scent. So this is Black Cherry Palm and Merlot. Handcrafted Bubble Elixir. Um, a Twister Retreat exclusive. And then the artwork is at Tom Traveler. So this is a four ounce. So I love the scent. Um, yeah, it smells really good. I love these. I love receiving these. Um, I love the design on it. So I'm happy with this. So that's very cool. Uh, let me see if it's on here. So a diary of blood. Wait. Yeah, a diary of blood. Ex um, Okay, so it is on here, the Diary of Blood Elixir, um, which I feel like I pronounced it wrong right now, but anyways. Enjoy your exclusive A Diary of Blood inspired bubble elixir slash shower gel by FictionBowCo.com um, and at Fiction Bath Co. Um, so yeah, I like these. These are nice to receive and I really enjoyed uh, Diary of Blood, the book. So that's really cool that we got an item inspired by that. Um, yeah, I'm happy with it so far. Uh, and then the next thing we have this month is a enamel pin. This is Seriously Scary Buck Stack. And then, yeah, so that's really cool. I like enamel pins. They're just fun and nice to get. Um, I like receiving them. And I love, I love this one. This one is so cool. Because it has a whole bunch of horror books on here. So they have Carrie. Frankenstein, um, the Hatina Hill House, Dracula, and Poe, and there's a skull, there's spider web, there's creepy candles, and I, I love the design, so I love this enamel pen, um, so, so, so cool. So, yeah, so far this probably might be one of my favorite boxes I received from Twister Treat, um, so, yeah. So let's go ahead and grab our next item, which is a coffee. So we have a coffee this month for our beverage. So each month in these Twitter retreat box, they give us a drink or a coffee. So yeah, um, actually let me read um, what they put for the Enema Pen real quickly. Um, the Enema Pen, enjoy this exclusive spooky stack design by Arsa.Arts for this box. Okay, so there's that. And then we have the coffee, Twitter retreat, revive me, coffee to save your soul. So I love that. So this is from Fair Duncan Coffee Co. Decor, <laughs> roasted in Texas. So yeah. So rise from the dead with this month's beverage, a delightful coffee. And then the company that I told you from, kind of hard to read, but that's really nice. Um, I'm excited to try this out. I love coffee, so I like the item. And then let's move on to our next item. Okay, so we have some utensils here, um, which is interesting because I just received some from Illumicrate. But let's go ahead and see this one. Okay, so here's our utensils. So we get two forks, two spoons, and a knife. So they have a knife design on them. So hopefully you guys can see that. Um, so we get like a very small fork and then like a normal size fork here with the same pretty flowery design. We get a kind of big spoon um, and then a very tiny spoon. So um, I love these, um, they're nice. Um, <laughs> I know I kind of hate it on the Illumicrate ones, but I kind of like them. Um, and I kind of like these too. So they're, they're a nice item. <laughs> um, so let me see um, what this is. So a set of utensils, this eggland gothic utensil will make the perfect touch of something dark in your kitchen. Um, they were designed by Lee underscore Berry for this box. Utensils are high food grade quality. It is recommended to hand wash. So 
there's those i like those and they're fun they're nice <laughs> and then the last thing we have here i think before the book is this which i have no idea what this is um so let me see on our spoiler card here so this is a rustic candle holder they are three three possible candle holder options which one did you get oh so it seems like maybe there's three different ones okay um each candle holder looked like it was part from an old haunted house it will make a lovely accent to your home it's from the heart side collection so you just put a candle in here i guess um so that's pretty cool um, I do like it. Um, I wonder if it fits, I'm assuming. No, it doesn't fit this candle, but like probably one of those color candles or something. So, um, this is my least favorite item, but, um, it's okay. Cause I really enjoyed everything else that we received. So yeah, so let's go ahead. And I think we're down to the book now. Yes. So this book this month is Claw Heart Mountain by David Opgard. So let me go ahead and take the shrink off, shrink wrap off <laughs> real quickly. And I can say that I really like the color of this book and the foiling is so nice. Um, so here's the cover. I think it looks beautiful. I love the foiling. And this is a redesigned cover. Um, let me see if I can show you the original. So here's the original from the spoiler card here. Hopefully you guys can see that. I kind of like the original cover, but I'm not mad at this, especially with the following. I think it looks pretty nice. Um, so yeah, this is pretty nice looking. And then we have the top of our sprayed edges and then on the bottom as well. And then on the side, so it looks like wood and just some claw marks on it. So I think it looks really nice and pretty cool looking. So I like that. So let's go ahead and take off the dust jacket. There's nothing underneath this. On the naked hardback, this is this is beautiful. I love this. I love the bear um, bear print, and then the cabin, the blood, the trees, the two gold and red foiling. I think I think it looks wonderful. So I really like that. And then on the back, we have some claw marks in red foiling and it looks beautiful. I love it. Um, and then we got these end pages. So these are beautiful. Um, they're nice. And then they're the same on the back as well. And I think it might be fine or it might be digital. Um, so it's either a sign or is a digital printed signature. Can't really tell. I think it might be digital though. Um, and then there's that. So, and then on the chapter headings, there's some claw marks. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with this box. I love everything that we received um, in this box. To be honest, everything was great. And I love the book. The book is beautiful. Um, so it says what happens when good people make one bad decision. Um, imagine you are on your way to a remote mountain cabin with your friends. Upon arrival, you discover an abandoned armored van with $15 million on board. Would you take the money? Noah and her friends answer with a resounding yes. Perhaps their answer would have been different had they known that a professional killer was already tracking them, tracking down the money. Or that a legendary creature known as the Ref roams the mountain river sea with hunger. Thinking they're safe and anonymous, Nova and her friends dive up, dive up the stolen cash, unaware who or what is after them. Unaware that soon they will be fighting for their lives. Something hungry has woken on Claw Heart Mountain. So that sounds really, really good, honestly. So I think I want to read this probably this week because I'm so interested in that. That sounds really interesting. So I'm excited to read this. I love this box. I love the items. I love the book. So let me know your thoughts. Um, comment below. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.